On our last market episode, we asked you guys to suggest your favorites. And our old buddy Darren said we had to check out public and quality meats in Fulton Market. Which shows we listen, huh? we care, uh -huh. we love. But I'm still not gonna share any with you guys. All right, Joe, I'm, ne I'm never happier than when I'm surrounded by meat. Meat and, and butchering and that kind of stuff. So public and quality meats is, is my kind of, my kind of vacation. It, it's, it's your shindig, it's your, it's your, uh, your haven. So tell us a little bit about public and quality meats. So we're about five years old now. Ta-da! Ta yeah, ta-da! We produce sandwiches, full-on charcuterie program, six to 800 pounds of sausage a week. You can get deli meats, you can get raw meats, you can get sausages, you can get cheese. You name it, we got it. That level of quality and detail, they apply to everything. So if you get cheese here, you know it's gonna be top-notch cheese. If you get meat here, you know it's gonna be top-notch meat. It's always fresh, always delicious. So if I'm looking for something fresh and something interesting, it's kind of a one-stop shop. I want to learn the ways of the butcher today, so what can we do? We're gonna go downstairs and grind some sausage right now. I'm all about it. All right. Okay. I like it. So I see we're at the, in the sausage making factory area. That is correct. This is a four horsepower grinder. This thing will eat just about anything. Joe's sausage process takes four days start to finish. So today, we're grinding chorizo. But we won't be eating chorizo. What? More on that later. One of them. You dig your hands in there. You're gonna kind of push it around. You're just gonna even it out. We're gonna kick this bad boy on. You're just gonna set it in. A good handful at a time. You slow it down just a little bit. Did it go through too fast? It's, it's all rhythm, you know what I mean? So this, this chorizo is now ready to start its four-day process? That is correct. But so. you guys have a continuing production line, so we have some ready to go and make upstairs? We do, absolutely. Okay. So. God, it never gets any easier, Joe. Never gets any easier. When you talk about a market, when you talk about a butcher, you think simplicity, you think old school, especially being in the meatpacking district, and, and then you present this. It, it is something special. We try to make it look nice, but you know, the way it tastes is much more important. You know, we're not pretentious here. We're still a butcher shop. We're friendly. We made the chorizo. However, However we're not enjoying the chorizo. We are not. So we are enjoying Cajun boudin. It's predominantly pork. It has some bacon, chicken livers, very high spice profile. Should we dive in? Please, by all means. Oh, nothing like a good market day. Mm. That tastes like all kinds of good things, right? It's just a powering bombardment of yep. spice. Punchy, spicy, fresh. That's like the hustle and bustle of the old school meatpacking district bouncing mm. around your tongue. That boudin is incredible sausage. Mm. 